I've played all over the world at some of the great venues, the Sydney Opera House, Carnegie Hall. But all of that aside, my favorite audience to play for is right here at the ASPCA. As a professional violinist, I spend a lot of time on stage under bright lights and you know, with sort of feeling like the world is watching. Here, the world that's watching is you know, my best friends. <laughs> that are wagging their tails and will like it no matter what I do. I think wanting to become a volunteer at the ASPCA uh, for me was rooted in my uh, desire to reconnect with animals. I've been an animal person all my life. I had a family dog uh, that I was very fond of and the loss of her many years ago was very difficult and I saw working at the ASPCA as a volunteer as a way to reconnect and to uh, get back in touch with the animals that I love so much. On my uh, application to become a, a volunteer, I sort of jokingly wrote, maybe I'll play the violin for dogs. I had no idea that there was a program that would even lend itself to that. At the Animal Recovery Center, um, we're treating animals that have been victimized either by direct physical trauma or long-term neglect that results in chronic medical conditions. And over time, as they're here, we are working to recover them, not only medically, but behaviorally. The volunteer support that Martin provides as part of a greater volunteer program called the Storytelling Program in which volunteers come and read to our dogs. In this case, Martin is delivering music to our dogs. They're providing much needed socialization. This brings the dogs um, an opportunity to meet new people and learn that strangers bring good things. Here, I just feel like I can come and just make music and I know that no matter what comes out, really, that, that, that my audience is going to, in some way, benefit from, at least that's my hope. <laughs> it's an emotional experience, uh, and it has been from day one. I can get attached very quickly to uh, some of these dogs I've played for, and then a week or two will pass and I'll come back and some of those dogs will not be here. I have to say to myself, well, I'm happy that the dog has gotten better and is ready to move on to the next chapter in their life. And maybe there will be music there as well. Hey, say hi. There you go. There you go. You're such a good audience. <laughs>